Your prerequisite is Time Maker Matrix Lesson 12, Massive Nuke. In this short lesson, we will take a look at the Massive Operation pull-down menu. This allows you to do a normal Time Maker action, but to a whole group at once. Now, whatever group that is, is based on either everything in the matrix or whatever you filtered, and we'll take a look at that later. So if we click this here, it opens the pull-down menu, and the first option is Massive Action date change. If we click this, all selected items on the matrix will be date moved to the target date which we select here. As you can see, we are presented with a little matrix and we can see work codes, for example, or everything we need. So we can decide where do we want to date change it to. So let's say I choose the 9th. I can go here to the 9th, double click it, and everything will be date moved. Make sense? All right. The next option is massive action reassigned. All selected items on the matrix will be reassigned to a new performer. When we click it, the system opens a window where you will be able to select a new performer. Okay, so we would type in here, for example, Mary Rose, and now all the items on the matrix will have Mary Rose as the performer. And that would happen if I clicked OK. The next option is Massive Action Delegate. All selected items on the matrix will be delegated to a new owner. When clicking this, the system opens a window where you will be able to select a new owner. So I can say, okay, I want Mary Rose to be the owner of all the items on my matrix. And then I click OK. Now the last option is Massive Action Deleted. All selected items on the matrix will be deleted. So clearly you're not going to do this to your whole matrix at once. And you probably wouldn't use any of these for your whole matrix at once but it comes in handy when you are filtered on a particular thing. And I'll give you a couple of examples. Let's say we want to filter Mary Rose as the performer, but Mary Rose no longer works in my company. So all these tasks are sitting there and well, I don't really have anything to do with them. But what I can do is a massive action reassigned and say, okay, now Naomi Straff is the new performer of all of Mary Rose's tasks since obviously Mary Rose is in, in the company to do them. And if I click OK, that'll happen. Also, you could do the same thing. Let's say I wanted Mary Rose to be the owner. Let's say she did work in my company and I want her to take care of a few of my items. I can filter all of my items as an owner. OK, and we find me all the items. These are the items I'm an owner. I can say, you know what, I'm going to be out of the office for the next two weeks. so. I'm going to delegate all these items to Mary Rose. Okay, does that make sense? And of course, you can think of times when you might need to date change a group or delete. And that's how it works. And that concludes Time Maker Matrix Lesson 13. Your next recommended lesson is the Save Buttons Lesson 14, the final Matrix Tutorial. See you there.